hello my lovely people welcome again to my channel in this video we will update windows drivers automatically with just a few clicks this means that you do not need to visit the computer manufacturer's website to manually download them also i will share with you important tips regarding the best driver updates for your computer hardware first of all let's check for missing drivers on this computer to do this go to start and type device manager and press enter. Here you see there are missing drivers for your hardware. So to install the drivers, right click on the hardware, select update driver, select search automatically for updated driver software. Please wait for the process to complete. After the process is complete, do the same for the others. Right click on the hardware, update driver, search automatically for updated driver software. Now, let's look at the other tips that I mentioned earlier. Please note that after fresh Windows installation, Microsoft Windows have installed most required drivers for your PC hardware except for graphics and sound. Those drivers you see installed for them are generic drivers. Please try and update them even if you don't see any sign of caution or missing drivers against them. For an instance, if you use the display driver at Microsoft Basic Display Adapter and you play high definition movies or use high graphical applications, you might experience glitches or distortions in your video applications like bad picture quality or screen tearing. Let's check something here. I'm getting display adapters at Microsoft Basic Display Adapter. If you see Microsoft Basic Display Adapter as your Intel graphics chip, it means that the appropriate video driver for this hardware has not been installed. Let's see the property section of this video adapter for more information. So let's minimize this. Right click, we go to display settings. Now we scroll down and we go to advanced display settings. Now we click for display adapter properties for display one. Look at the graphics card details. It's saying total available graphics memory is 4053 megabytes. Dedicated video memory is 0 megabytes. System video memory is 0 megabytes. Shared system memory is 4053 megabytes. The main focus here should be on the dedicated video memory, which should not be 0. It should be either 64 megabytes, 128 megabytes. 256 megabytes or probably more and not zero now let's update the display driver to see if there's any form of variations here right click update driver search automatically for updated driver software now let's wait for the process to complete Now we can see the actual model name of the video card, Intel HD 4600 and not Microsoft Basic Display Adapter. Now let's go to the property section once more. Yes, so we can see now the total available graphic memory 2176 megabytes, dedicated video memory 128 megabytes. That is our main focus. 
the dedicated video memory which is 128 and not zero please take note i hope this video finds you all now you know the main areas to focus on when updating or downloading drivers for your pc after new installation thank you so much for watching stay blessed and i'll see you again in another video